punch a punch punch hey hi I'm Dan or Crunchlins as you might know me from from this channel and uh, I want to start off by updating you a little bit um, there's no cartoon this week as you may have guessed I'm not, not currently animated but there will be cartoons coming very very soon uh, part of the reason there's not one today is because a I'm filming this B because I'm working on a huge collaboration project with five other animators um, there's Apex Wolf, HD Revel, Shari 5, Now Elch and Lightson um, and we made the same sort of collaboration last year where um, I have a cartoon called Pikachu Banished Bill's PC and that was part of a collaboration where four of us I think um, made Pokemon animations we're doing the same thing this year but with six of us so that is in the pipeline we will announce the deadline and stuff but you know I'm also working on an animated me but I'm also just swamped with commission work and stuff so don't worry I've not gone away and I am fully intending to still be uploading every uh, other Friday so um, the second reason I wanted to film this video was to say thank you to you for helping me to hit 25,000 subscribers on this channel that's a lot of people I know to some of the bigger channels that doesn't seem like a, a big number and they probably get that in a couple of days but um, that's a lot of people like when you think that they won't fit in my house um, anyway so I thought I'd thank you by answering any questions you guys had so um, here's the 25,000 subscriber AMA yeah so here are my questions so question one how old are you I am 24 years old or 24 years young as they say um, shit I'm gonna start this again because I've been wrestling papers Question two, where are you from? I'm from England in the United Kingdom. Are you open to collaborating on cartoons? Says question three. Yes, I am, uh, but it depends on timing because sometimes like now I'm absolutely swamped and I just can't take on any more animations because I want to keep up to date with my YouTube schedule and I don't want to break that. Occasionally I have to when I'm really, really, really busy because I, I need to eat and stuff like that, sleep. But yeah, I'm open to it, so if you do want to collaborate, then feel free to contact me, um, and I will let you know if I can do it. Question 4. What is your favourite Pokemon that you've drawn so far? What have I even drawn? You know what, I, I actually enjoyed this week's, which was Geodude, Graveler, and Gollum. Um, I'd never drawn, I'd drawn Geodude before for Pokemon Adventure and other cartoons, but um, Graveler I'd never drawn, although I kind of thought that he looked like some porridge, um, but Gollum was really cool to draw because he um, is round and kind of like a stony piece of popcorn. So yeah, this, this week's. Question 5, which Pokemon would you least likely to own in real life? Do you know what, Trubbish and Gabador, because... I don't particularly struggle to find rubbish around, and I certainly wouldn't pick it up and raise it as my own. So, Trubbish and Gabador. Question six, which Pokemon would you be? Hmm. I'd like to think I'd be something cool like Charmeleon, but in reality I'd probably be something more like Weedle or Paris. Question seven, what's your favorite thing to doodle? I have a habit of doodling like either Sora from Kingdom Hearts or Cloud Strife from Final Fantasy 7. I kind of drew them enough when I was younger that I kind of just my hand just does it when I'm when I have a pen in my hand. Question eight: Does art lie in the family? Um, my dad's very artistic, and my mum's into interior design and stuff, and my sister's artistic. So yeah, actually. Question nine: If you could be locked in a room with anyone for one day. Who and why? Hmm. Hmm. That's a good question. Zach Braff would be funny to be in a room with for a day. 
don't know, he seems like he'd be fun. <sighs> Sum yourself up in three words. I am Dan. Goofy... Goofy, tired, and... Luxurious. Question 11. What cheers you up? I like watching TV shows, so at the moment I particularly am enjoying watching uh, Breaking Bad again and Supernatural again. Um, but I'm a big fan of The Walking Dead, Arrow, uh, um, Sherlock. Yes, it makes me happy. Question 12. How awesome is your girlfriend on a scale of 1 to 10? And then in brackets it says, tread carefully. My lawyers have advised me to say, a hundred out of ten. But in all seriousness, she is a very awesome girlfriend. Question 13. If you had a time machine, how would you use it? I would use a time machine to bring somebody like Henry VIII into modern day times. And just sort of brag about how awesome everything is now. Like, just be casually driving my car and they'd be kind of like, What is this? Glorious machine. This is the devil's work. And I'd just be like, no, sweat man, it's just my car. So, um, I'd do that. I would use it for bragging purely. Question 14. How do you cope with negative comments? Um, I usually just ignore them, um, because I kind of think if you've not got anything nice to say, uh, don't say it at all. If you're, like, offending people, then I can understand why you'd be getting negative comments, but I try not to offend too many people, so I just ignore negative comments, or I very politely explain to them um, that the stuff I make is not meant to be, like, factually accurate. I'm not making documentaries, I animate parody and comedy cartoons. Question 14. Oh, we've already done question 14. Question 15. Opinions on pooping? Um, it's a necessity. Uh, yes, it's very necessary. Question 16. Guilty pleasures. Pooping. Question 17. What's it your dream to animate one day? I really want to animate like a film or something at some time. I know it would take ages. Um, but I'd like to make something that's not strictly just comedy, but it's kind of... Um, kind of family friendly but also not not like too watered down kind of thing so I'd, I'd kind of like to make something a bit like Big Hero 6 or something like that that's kind of epic, really cool really funny and just fun for everyone to watch maybe like a, an, an action adventure kind of thing uh, I don't know, I really want to make comics and stuff as well So, uh, question 18 how are you so awesome? This question came from Wyatt the Nerd. I've always liked you, Wyatt. You're a darling. Um, to answer the question, uh, I mean, I was just born this way. Question 19. What made you want to animate? A friend of mine back in school animated for, like, he was on Newgrounds and stuff. And um, I saw one of his cartoons and I kind of was like, oh, I didn't realise you could do that without you know, having a studio behind you, so I gave it a go, and then I left it for years, and then I kind of, rem I, I was being taught how to make animated GIFs, and I was like, oh yeah, I can make cartoons, so uh, I just got back into it, and really I suppose it stems from the fact that I always drew stuff when I was little, I really liked drawing, and that was basically my main pastime, other than playing with like action figures and bionicles and stuff like that. So uh, those are all the questions that I received on this occasion. If you want to ask more questions and want me to answer them, uh, leave comments down in the comment section. Um, I will be starting up podcasts again soon. I did record one recently with HD Rebel and Apex Wolf, but for some reason the sound quality came out a lot worse than expected. Um, so I want to re-record re that, because otherwise you're going to be listening for 20 minutes or whatever to me being... Like round a hole, like that. So, um, so ask questions in the comments below, and we'll answer them in the podcast because I'm planning to do them quite regularly. So, special thanks to Lightson, Wyatt the Nerd, Sarah from Sarah and Back Again, Alan Bustos, 
Jilvic Gamers DK, Dolan Gleiser, and J Deegan123. For all the questions. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. And thank you to everyone else for helping us to reach uh, 25,000 subscribers. That is a very vast number. That's an incredible number, and I do really, really appreciate it. I try and comment to every single comment if I can, unless you're a dick, and then I don't reply. Um, but I try to respond to every comment if I can. So thank you for all the comments. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing my videos. Thank you for everything. It's really cool. Um, and I never really thought I'd get to in the thousands um, of subscribers. It took me about half a year to get about 80 subscribers. So um, thank you very much. You're awesome. And I love you very much. Not in a romantic way, you understand. Let's keep this strictly business. Bye. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you. If you think you'd like to watch another cartoon, click the link on the screen. And I almost forgot Also you can subscribe uh, Gotta go now and do some Some crazy stuff uh.